Hello everybody, welcome back. We are another day closer to this holiday weekend. How many of you guys have Good Friday off for this holiday weekend? I have Good Friday off, so I'm, I'm excited for a nice long weekend. I probably will be spending most of it doing yard work. Me and my dad, we're going to go ham and just take care of a bunch of things outside. So I'm going to be spending most of my time probably outside. So I'm hoping the weather is nice. Today I have brought back my MRRGB. Now that stands for Mini Random Rainbow Glue Book. I was just kind of craving this and I really wanted to do something colorful. So I thought let's bring this out. We can work on a small little page. But today I I'm only going to use images and pieces that all came in Happy Mail. So I'm going to use nothing but stuff that I received from Happy Mails, except maybe I might throw in like a cut and collage image or two here and there. So what my mini random rainbow glue book is, is it's just, it's a mini book. It's a smaller size. Um, it's also a rainbow book. So we have pages all in colors, but then it's also random too. So I draw and select colors at random for these pages. So how I do that is I wrote down the colors on pieces of paper here and we're just going to randomly draw a color. I have no idea what we're going to get. I'm real excited. Let's see what we got to work with today. Teal. Ooh, we haven't done that one yet. Okay. Okay. I'm excited. See, we haven't done any teal. I know we haven't. We had a pink and then we had a brown. Then we had two oranges in a row, which was crazy. And then we had a yellow, a purple, and then I did some like color mashes. So I did two random colors. And this one was pink and blue. And this one was yellow and blue. So now we're gonna do just a solid teal. Ooh, I'm excited. All right, so let's just start digging through all of the fun goodies and all the things that I have received from you guys in Happy Mail packages. I kind of kept everything together. A lot of it still needs to be uh, organized too because uh, I still have to go through and you know separate it. I like to get all the fussy cuts together and all the squares and rectangles together. So let's see, can we find anything that's teal in here? Ooh, this is a really cool book. <gasps> wow, this is cool. It's gonna have any teal in it though? I don't know, we just gotta flip and look. Oh. Some really gorgeous pictures in here. We are looking for teal. Teal is actually kind of a hard color. Let's see, it says too, it's too blue, darn. Teal is a bit of a hard color to find. I know I kind of struggle with, ooh, hold up. That chair could be considered teal. I don't know. What do you guys think? Like, what do you consider teal? Like, is that closer to teal or is that too blue? I don't know. Cause, cause teal, it, it teal is kind of like a iffy, uh, balance. It can swing either more green or it can swing more blue. So it's like, what, where, where does the teal actually lie? Like, we're looking for some teal colors here. Something, something we can work with. There's a lot of colors in this magazine. This is also what's fun too, is this hunting down the colors. Hunting down the colors, ooh, that's pretty. That's definitely teal. Trying to find something that might be teal. Oh, that border, that that's a pretty good teal, but I don't have it's not enough. It's like I need more. Teal. We might not find it in this magazine. We'll just have to keep looking. Let's see. Plenty of other colors, but not the color that we need. We don't need much either because this is, this is a mini, this is a mini glue book. So it doesn't need a whole lot. It just needs something small, something small for the background. But do you think I could find that? No. Why would it want it? Why would it do that? I mean, that's 
on the green. Whoa, that's trippy. Oh my gosh, is that trippy. <laughs> wow. There's a lot of great images in this magazine. Didn't find any teal though. Hmm, well that's a bummer. That's okay. Oh, hang on, we might have something here. This this carpet right here, that looks really cool. I'm actually liking that. Maybe I can get that out. I'm trying, oh, I don't want it to rip the whole thing. So, I like that, that carpet there. It actually looks really good. Anyway, I don't think there's any more. I think we've looked through everything already. All right. Basically, we're just trying to find the backgrounds right now. Just trying to find, trying to find, fill in the background. <clears throat> but I do like, I do like that. That carpet there. Let's go ahead and cut that out. All right, let's see. We probably start with it down here, probably. That'd actually be a good spot. Start with something at the bottom. Maybe we can fill something on the top here. I got something. I like this image right here. Like like this this top section here. That looks kind of kind of like a dirty teal to me. Is what I'm I'm seeing. It's almost like a dirty teal, but it's really pretty. And that would be so cool with that. Wouldn't that, or should I just, or should I leave the whole, mm, darn. I almost like the whole picture as a whole. So maybe I shouldn't, maybe I shouldn't do that. I don't want to cut that up. Oh, here we go. I found this in the basket. Or is that too blue, do you think? Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. Well, we're still, we're still you know, digging through stuff. Let's just start with this because I know for sure that I want this. We're going to start with this piece. Let's see, it's going to be about down here at the bottom. So I'm going to glue on this, on the book here, so I know. Okay. Oops, Oops. making a mess with the glue stick. All right, and there we go. And there's still a nice, nice chunk here that I could still use if I want to. I want to use it elsewhere. Let's go ahead and trim it off. save that just in case we might want to use that. All right, let's just grab another magazine here and see what else we can find. Give myself some room here. All right, we need teal. Can we please find some teal? Hang on, I need space. Oh, I had to put the big basket on the floor. Oop, can you guys see? I'm gonna zoom you back just a little bit here. All right, let's see what we can find. Oh, that's pretty green. Oh, that is so pretty. We don't want green. We want teal. Find some teal. Teal, teal. We need some we need teal. Ooh, these are cute. These little tags here. Those are adorable. Oh, okay. Yep, you can cut these out. Oh, that's perfect. Do I want one of those on there, though? Well, at least I know where they're at, so I can always come back to that if I want them. Oops, I missed a few pages. 
<gasps> oh, that's pretty. Ooh. I like that. That would be a really cute. Oh my gosh. That would be perfect to cut out and stick on there. Okay. Oh shoot. How am I going to get that out? I'm going to have to. All right. There we go. <laughs> Just rip, rip the book in half. That's how you get it out. There. All right. I want to put that on there because that is cute. We're going to use that as a fussy cut image. That is adorable. Oh, I love that so much. All right, still looking for teal. Oops, sorry guys. What is that? Oh, look at the pink. Wow, it's a shame we're not doing pink. Darn it. Let's see, any more teal? Hmm. Oh, those punch out. Oh, okay, wow. Hang on. Like this border stuff here. Do you see that border around those? That, that is pretty actually. So like these, these, uh, these things punch out. But then you can get this border on this side. Oh shoot, man. I'm gonna keep looking. See what I can, else I can find. Ooh. That's cool. I could use that as a top. Actually, I think that would look really good with this. That actually matches really well if I cut that out and just do kind of like the sky. <gasps> that looks really good, actually. I think I might do that. Just rip another section of that out so we can get this page out. All right, perfect. That's basically what I was looking for. I think this is like a spot the difference kind of thing, but we ain't gonna use it for that. No, I would do that. We need it just for the sky. Okay, let's see. Actually, I don't mind getting the bottom part too, because that's actually kind of cute. I want to get much of the sky. Let's see. So this bottom comes to about here. I'm going to trim just a teensy bit more off the bottom. Okay. Trim a little bit more off the side here. I need to make it like straight so it's nice and even on that side. And I'm going to trim off that top. I don't want that purple line in there. Okay, and then stick that there. Oh my gosh, that actually looks so cute. Doesn't that look so cute and pretty? I love that so much. All right, awesome. Okay, let's go ahead and figure out where I'm gluing. Actually, I'm gonna start by working on this side here. Mm, better do this <laughs> on the plastic. And I'm going to need another glue stick. It's a very clo cold, cloudy day today, you guys. I think I actually saw some snow flurries on my drive home today. I'm like, no, it's like it needs to stop doing that. All the snow is finally melted from that up. Uh, Oh my gosh, I can't get the cap off this. Oh, yikes, there we go. Yeah, all the snow is melted from the last crazy snow mess that we had, but it's still on the colder side, so it can still snow if it decides to. <laughs> I'm like, no, don't snow anymore. We don't want it. All right. Let's go ahead and get that. Oop, not too close to that. All right. Oh, that's so pretty. I love that so much. 
I like that. This one is turning out really nice. Very, very elegant. It's turning out really elegant, and I love that. All right, let's get this trimmed off. And I can still save this piece because that's a really cute little piece. Ooh, gotta trim off a bit more here around the corner. Now, let's, ew, ew, sticky, ew, messy, sticky, gooey mess, sticky everywhere. Let's go ahead and fussy cut this out. This is so pretty. Okay, what's on the, what's on the other side, though? Oh, that's fine. I actually can, I actually can cut out all these little perfume bottles. They're so pretty. Really pretty. Mm. This is a really cute image. This is something that you could actually find in a cut and collage book. I found it in this magazine. Alright, we got to get around all the details. I want this nice and detailed. So we're going to take our time and really get the nice details. And then I gotta look for some more cute little things. I think I have some stickers, maybe. I gotta look through more of my stash. And maybe try and find some words or something. Should I throw some words on here? I don't know, I still kinda like that shiny, that shiny holographic paper. I might still stick that on here. Maybe we'll put that in behind the uh, the perfume bottle. Make that look really cute. So many fine details on this thing. Oh my gosh. Okay, there. Finally, on the big page. Okay, I'm gonna get some more details into this one. Make it look cool. You definitely, if you want the details in your fussy cut, you just, you definitely gotta take, take the time to do it. Take your time. The end result is so nice. This was definitely a really cute find. All right, I gotta get inside here. All right, guys, a bit of quiet here. We're concentrating. <laughs> this is delicate work. We must have complete silence for concentration. <laughs> All right, there we go. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. It goes so good with that page. I love it so much. Even just right there in the middle. It's, it, it's just perfect. It really matches that carpet too. Isn't that gorgeous? <gasps> Oh my gosh, I love that so much. Okay, does this piece go with it? Should I throw that on there? Should we throw some of that shiny? Mm. You know, no, no, not feeling it. I'm not, it just, it almost, almost takes away from it. Whereas I just love that perfume bottle just as it is. I don't even think... I don't even think I'd want to add anything more to it. Just that alone is, it's, it's perfect. But I'm going to still go ahead and just look a little bit more. Anyways, I'm going to bring my 
big basket back, and I'm just going to go ahead and just going to dig through and see what we can find here. Just in case I do see something else I can throw on there. Something teal. Oops, sorry guys. Didn't mean to bump. Didn't mean to bump ya. There's like small images and big images. This is the basket where I just I just dumped it all. This is stuff that still has to be sorted and organized. Fussy cut through and all that fun jazz. I just dumped it all into the basket. So everything is in here. <laughs> Everything's in here. Kind of hard to see some of it, so I'm just really skimming through it basically. I might be skipping quite a lot, but I can't get through. I don't want to go through all, all of it. Ooh. There's a teal, but I don't like, don't like that image. I mean, even if I don't find anything, this alone right here still looks perfect. I'm maybe looking for like another fussy cut image or something or even a word would be good that's cool let's see hold on what's this there's something oh it's just a pool it's the pool reflection we don't want that I don't want that Hold up, I just saw something in here. We have a piece of fabric. Now that's different. I like that. Should we try and add a piece of fabric into this? I mean, that's like the perfect teal. I really like that. The other teal things in here. Hmm. No, it's just I like that piece of fabric. I want to try and figure out how to make that work. I don't have my fabric scissors with me though. Darn it. Okay, let's see if I can try and cut out a piece with my paper scissors here. Just a little strip here. And what I'm thinking is I just want to have it on the side right here like this. Right there. If I kind of glue that on top like that. <gasps> Isn't that cute? Oh, I like that. I like that. Okay, we're gonna have to do that because I like it so much. We we have to do that. Oh, I need like I needed some words or something. Okay, hang on. I do have some words actually organized, so let's see. Let's see, where did the words? Here we go. Hang on. I see one already, but I don't know what it says. What does this say? It says peace of mind and it's teal. Oh my gosh. Could that be any more perfect? Oh, I love that so much. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I like that so much. There's some more in here. Let's see what else we got. This is more like a darker teal. What does this one say? Oh, this one says achieve. Ooh, and it's in a darker teal. I, I actually like that too. Should I kind of put that behind there. Oh, I'm liking this. I'm liking this. I'm liking where this is going. Hang on. There's another one here. Oh, this one says the right place. That's a little too big. So we're going to skip that one. Let's see. 
Nope. Any more in there? Okay, I don't see any more. That's okay. Let's look through. I got more fussy cuts here. Got more fussy cuts. Let's see if we can't find any more teal fussy cuts. Hmm. No, nope, I'm not seeing. I'm not seeing anything, but that's okay because what we we got quite a bit going on right here, and I really like this. I really like this. Ooh, it's turned out so good. Okay, so kind of have it like that with that what do we think guys what do we think i like that so much oh my gosh okay we're going with it we're going with it because it's it's perfect all right so the first one we got to glue down is probably this piece of fabric actually we can do the peace of mind up at the top get that peace of mind have peace of mind yes we all need that we need just peace of mind I love that. That's perfect. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. But now since I'm gluing down fabric, I actually have to use my fabric tack. Now I haven't used this yet. So I got to open it up. I got to open it up and use it for the first time. All right. It's on there good and tight. Okay, mm, should I glue onto the fabric? Yeah, I'm, okay, let's see how this, let's see how this works. I've never used fabric tack before. Just gonna put a little squiggly across here. Ooh, this is very sticky stuff, very sticky. Ooh, stringy too, ooh, it's got glue, glue webs. Ooh, it's got glue webs. All right, and then we're just gonna Press it down, get it on there. Okay, I'm gonna put the cap back on that right away. Okay. Ooh, it does actually have a bit of a smell. It's got a bit of a smell. Not too bad. All right, next we're gonna glue down our Achieve. It's gonna go right here, I think. Yeah, because this is gonna be right about the middle. I want that one about right there. And then if I find something else, I do have another small little space right here that I can always throw something on. So, oops, no, achieve goes first. So, that way there is there is extra space in case I do find something else. Actually, I didn't really look at the stickers. Maybe I should look at the stickers, too, because I got some stickers that you guys have also sent me. So, maybe I should look through some stickers just in case. I like that. That's cool. Throwing in a little something different besides just paper. We got a bit of fabric in there. That is cool. And it's the perfect color. Oh my gosh, I love this so much. This one turned out really good. I think my favorite piece is probably this little perfume bottle. This is gotta be my most favorite piece. Was the best find. Hands down. Best find in there. All right, let's see if we can't find maybe a sticker or two. I know I've got some, got some stickers. Let's see. Oops. Oh, some letter stickers. Okay. Ooh, that's pretty. That's more on the green side. It's not teal. Darn. Hmm. Oh, these little things are so cute. I love this one. It's got a little bit of teal. Isn't that cute? Should we throw that on there? I almost want to because it's so cute. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> look, look. We have to. I I I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. <laughs> Oh, 
didn't even have to stop to think. Absolutely, 100%. It goes there. It's perfect. I'm in love. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, there we go. What do you think, guys? We now have a teal page in my MRRGB. Isn't that adorable? Oh my gosh. That is so cute. Wow, that's exciting. A new color to add into the, the new little mini rainbow book. A new color. Because I don't think, yeah, we don't have a teal in here yet. We haven't done any teals. Which is awesome. Oh, that turned out so cute. And all from pieces and things that you guys have sent me in Happy Mail. So this page is dedicated to you guys. Thank you so very much. It would not have been possible without you and all of your wonderful contributions and the gifts that you send me. Thank you so much. There's still so much more that you guys have sent me and I'm still going through it all organizing. So we can make lots more pages yet in the future if you guys are up to it. So yeah, so I want to thank you again for the happy meal and all the fun stuff. This page turned out so very cute. Let me know what you guys think. Do you guys like the idea of the MRRGB? Do you like, you know, just miss mini rainbow pages that are random, not in rainbow order? Do you like doing the uh, the two random colors? These are my probably my favorite ones, the two random colors, because, you know, it's it's cool to, to try and fit two colors together that you don't know what you're going to get. But this one turned out so cute. I'm so very happy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it and going through all of the fun things, trying to put colors together. It's a lot of fun. I love colors. I, I, I love colors, so... This book is one of my favorites. It is absolutely one of my favorites. So if I had more time, I would definitely do another page. But, you know, it takes time to find the images. And, you know, I don't like to rush through it either. I really like to enjoy the process of, you know, on the hunt and digging for the colors and just looking through everything and, and then putting it together and seeing how it looks. So one page is about all we can manage per video. But... Let me know if you guys want me to do this some more because, you know, we got to fill up this whole thing. We have to fill it all up. So we got plenty more pages, lots more colors to come yet. I don't know. What colors have we not done yet? We haven't done a red. There hasn't been a green. And I think there's still, I think there is still black and white in here yet. So I think, we, I think there are still four colors we haven't done yet. I'm pretty sure there might be four colors that have not been, haven't been touched. Unless, did I put gray in there? I can't remember if I put the color gray in there. So there might be four or five. I'm not sure. I'll have to go through and, and double check what colors I actually have and find out what we haven't done yet. But look, we got a teal in here now. Yay! So with that being said, thank you again for joining me. You guys have a wonderful rest of your evening. Hope to see you in the video next video. And yeah, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Let me know in the comments down below what you thought and I'll see you in the next one. Keep on gluing everybody.